we have defined the Riemann upper integrals and Riemann lower integrals. Riemann upper integrals are defined by using the set of upper sums. Partitioning hai aapke paas, upper sums ka set aapke paas banta hai, correspond to each partition. Then infimum of that bounded set is known as the Riemann upper integral. Similarly, the Riemann lower integral is defined by using the set of Riemann lower sums. And in fact, the Riemann lower integral is the supremum of that set. Jo ke Riemann lower sums ka set hum ne banaya, uska supremum hai, ye jo lower integral humara hai. So we are going to show that if f is bounded on the closed interval a, b, then lower integral is always less than or equal to the upper integral. Now, in order to prove that statement, I will very, very frequently, I will use uh, the definition of supremum and infimum. Jo amne real number system discuss karte hoye, define bhi kiya tha, kuch properties bhi use ki thi, unko mein bada frequently jo hai, wo use karunga. So, let's see the result. If f is bounded on the closed interval, then the lower integral of f of x over the interval a, b is always less than or equals to the upper integral or isko graphically bhi aap dek, dek sakte hai. Mainne jaysay pehle explain kiya hua hai ki upper sums or lower sums kiya hai. Ab aap un upper sums or lower sums ki infimum, upper sums ki infimum or lower sums ki supremum dekhen. Ke wo kya ban rahi hai. You can see this particular mathematical results graphically jo hai usko bhi aap graphically bhi dekh sakte hain. But I am going to prove mathematically. Suppose that P1 and P2 are partitions of AB and P prime is a refinement of both P1 and P2. Ab refinement ke liye abhi humne lemma jo hai wo proof kiya tha ke upper sums agar P prime refinement hai to upper sums ye inequality jo hai satisfy karte hain. We have just proved right now. Or lower sums jo hain ye inequality satisfy karte hain. Upper sums ki inequality ko mein sterics se develop kar raha hon, denote kar raha hon, or lower sums ki jo hai double sterics se. Now we have to play very intelligently, letting p equals p1 in double steric. Agar double steric mein aap p equals p1 le lehen, to mere paas lower sum p1 less than equals to refinement lower sum of p refinement. Ye aega jo ke ye likha hua hai. Similarly, agar p equals p2 aap hysteric mein le lehen, to mere paas kya aajayega? s of p refinement, or ye mujhe pata hai, that is less than or equals to s of p2. Ye do inequalities jo hain, in dono inequalities jo ke humne already proved ki hui hain for a refinement obtained by adding r terms of p, ye humne proved ki thi. Inhi ko use karke, we are able to write down these two inequalities. Since S of P lower sum is always less than or equal to upper sum of any partition, ye hamesha true hota hai. This implies that S of P1, S of P2, thus every lower sum is a lower bound for the set of all upper sum. Is ka matlab hai ke set of all upper sum jo hai, wo uska har jo lower sum hai, wo lower bound hai. Since A, B, जो अपर इंटीग्रल है इट इज द इनफिमम इनफिमम क्या होती है ग्रेटेस्ट लोअर बाउंड होती है इनफिमम सो दिस इज द ग्रेटेस्ट लोअर बाउंड ये लोअर सम्स जो है अपर सम्स का लोअर बाउंड बन रही है और ये अपर रीमान अपर इंटीग्रल जो है ये ग्रेटेस्ट लोअर बाउंड है सो इज द इनफिमम ऑफ दिस सेट इट फॉलोस दैट s ऑफ p1 लेस देन इक्वल्स टू this one for every partition P1 of AB. This is by using the definition of the upper integral. This means that the upper integral is an upper bound. Ab ye vice versa. Jo mera set of lower sums hai. Iska matlab ye hua ke ye upper integral is a bound of all the lower sum. Or ye koon si bound hai? Upper bound hai. अब लोअर इंटीग्रल क्या होता है लोअर इंटीग्रल तो हमने डिफाइन किया था कि सेट ऑफ लोअर सम्स जो है उसकी सुप्रीमम है सुप्रीमम क्या होती है ग्रेटेस्ट लोअर बाउंड ठीक है 
so applies since a b is the supremum of this set this implies one jo ke humne proof karna tha so we have proved that the riemann lower integral of a bounded function f over the interval a b is always less than or equal to riemann upper integral of f on the bounded interval a b ye humne inequality jo hai ye proof kiya hai jo ke use humne kya kiya hai supremum aur infimum ki definition idea jo hai is proof mein yahi tha ki supremum aur infimum ki definition jo hai usko apply kiya 